Chapter 9 Looping Statements in QBasic Iterational Statements or Loops While writing a program, you might want to repeat the execution of certain set of statements a number of times. To make interesting and efficient programs, you can make QBasic to execute a part of a program more than once. This is called looping or iteration. When QBasic goes through a part of a program over and over again, looping statements are the statements which help you in creating the loops. Some of the looping statements which you will learn in QBasic are for, next, do loop. Any looping statement must have the following four components. Initialization, the value from where the loop starts. Termination, the value at which the loop ends. Step up or down. Specifies how the loop moves forward and backward. Body of the loop. Statements inside the loop that are to be executed repeatedly. For next statements. When you want a group of statements to be executed a specific number of times, you make use of for next statement. Syntax. For counter variable equal to initial value to final value, step value. Set of statements in a loop to be executed. Next, counter variable. Counter is the numeric value which controls the loop and is also known as the control or index variable. Every time the loop body gets executed, its value changes. Initial value is the starting value of the counter. Final value is the end value of the counter variable indicating the loop to exit. Step value is the value by which the counter variable is either increased or decreased every time when the loop body is executed. It can be either positive or negative but cannot be zero. The step value is not compulsory. If it is omitted, the counter variable is increased by one every time when the loop is executed. Next statement is the end of the loop. Program 1. Write a code to print. I am looping 5 times. Solution for C equal to 1 to 5. Print I am looping. Next C. Here control variable equal to C. Initial value of control variable equal to 1. Final value of control variable equal to 5. Step value equal to 1. This loop runs 5 times. The string I am looping appears 5 times on the output screen. Once the loop ends, the statements which are written after the loop are executed. Output Using step value for specifying the value by which control variable should change, you can provide a step value. In the following program, the control variable S changes by 3 every time the body loop gets executed. For S equal to 1 to 8, step 3. Print S. Next S. A negative number can also be assigned as the step value. In such cases, the value of the control variable is decreased by the step value every time when the loop is executed. If the step value is negative, then the initial value of the control value is more than the final value. For s equal to 8 to 1 step, minus 3. Print s, next s. Program 2. Write a program to display even numbers from 1 to 50. Solution. Rem even numbers from 1 to 50. CLS. For i equal to 2 to 50 step 2. Print i. Next i. End. Do loop statements. Many times you do not know the number of times a loop has to be executed. In such cases, the do loop is preferred over for next loop. There are two forms of the do loop. Do while loop, 
do until loop do while loop as long as the specified condition is true we make use of the do while loop if it is false control transfers to the first statement after the loop which marks the loop's end syntax do while condition statement bracket s loop the statements which are written between do while and loop form the body of the loop for example b equal to 3 do while b less than 5 print b b equal to b plus 1 loop the above loop is executed as long as the value of b is less than 5 if the condition in do while loop is not true the loop is not executed at all for example the loop will not execute for the following condition t equal to 8 do while t less than 8 print t loop before the loop is ended the counter variable must be incremented or decremented to avoid an infinite loop if the loop does not terminate it is called endless or infinite loop to end such a loop press control plus break program 3 to display even numbers less than 20 rem to display the even numbers less than 20 cls a equal to 2 do while a less than or equal to 20 print a a equal to a plus 2 loop do until loop it is almost similar to do while loop the only difference is that in the do until loop the execution of the loop continues as long as the condition is false it exits if the condition is true syntax do until condition statement bracket s loop let us take the following example c equal to 2 do until c greater than 4 print c c equal to c plus 1 loop print loop over the loop is executed as long as the condition c greater than 4 is false or as long as c is less than or equal to 4 program 4 write a program to display numbers from 30 to 20 solution cls n equal to 30 do until n less than 20 print n n equal to n minus 1 loop 30 29 28 27 26 25 24 23 22 21 20 press any key to continue exit command before the loop comes to an end on its own you can exit from a loop yourself use the exit for statement in the for next loop and the exit do statement in the do while loop or the do until loop